Hello everybody, welcome to the first episode of the How Can X Character Win Total Drama Action Series. This episode is Bridget's episode. Say hello to my adoring uh, co-host here. Hi, I'm adorable. <laughs> hey, I said I adoring, alpha. not adorable. I know, I know, and I forgive you, <laughs> but I am Alpha XX. <laughs> Alright, let's start. So, the major change here is that Bridget is going to have her head in the game this time, and not her head connected to Mouth. Jeff's. <laughs> She's going to have her head in the game, not her tongue in the Jeff. <laughs> exactly. In which case, I think things still go the same, as Bridget just sucks at everything she does. Bridget is really not a good contestant. People need to realize this. They really take Duncan's, like, statement at face value. Bridge, Bridge has never won a challenge for her life. She is completely useless to the team. The only challenge she's done is the trapeze challenge. Even then, that was just because of Harold. Yeah, Harold right. was the one that told her when to jump. Yeah. They should have kept Harold in the extreme floor, it's not Bridget. In which case... Um... I think I mean, Heather totally for sure is going. Nobody likes Heather. And then I think Jeff would be eliminated for some very similar reasons as in canon. I also think that Duncan could probably get the votes, because like we've never seen that Duncan and Jeff are still friends since Jeff betrayed Duncan. You're right. Um, like before, Gwen and Trent are the team leaders in episode 3 and they will choose very similarly. Uh, Duncan, and then it was... Lashana. Justin. Justin, because he's trying to get back at Gwen by having the Hulk people. DJ. Uh, Beth. Bridget would be picked here, instead of Heather. Owen would be picked. And then it would be... Izzy and Harold. Oh my gosh, the teams are so different. <laughs> <laughs> Episode 3 goes literally almost entirely the same, even to the yeah. point where Bridget is teaming with Harold. Yeah. As well as trying to pump DJ up to carry the cart, but he doesn't still. Do it, DJ, do it, DJ. Uh, I, we have no reason to believe, like, Bridget's involvement would actively ruin Duncan unless she does a similar thing in the talent contest. She Where throws she... up on Duncan. <laughs> she, like, drops a light on his head. <laughs> so, nah, if that doesn't Izzy's... happen, Izzy is gone. Oh and then, Bridget... Uh, who are we? Bridget would have no effect on the on the Trent Gwen. Gwen what's the tr Trent and Gwen ship name? Um, tr Gwent. Oh, Gwen. Oh. Um, Trent still does, you know, his thing. Do you have it in a G? You know. <laughs> People are like, oh man, it was just the nine thing. No, oh, fucking wasn't. <laughs> <laughs> Gwen gets eliminated next. Because even though, yeah. like, Bridget wants D Duncan gone, I don't think she'd take kindly to Gwen throwing challenges. Especially hitting Harold over the f over the head. Yeah. Uh, episode 8 was not an elimination. Or at least I don't but think it was. But it was. It was not. It was the medical, but it is slightly important. Oh, I yeah. do think that because Shauna would still try to approach Duncan, but after he says no, she'll go to Bridget. Instead yeah. of trying to insist. Yeah, I mean, there was a very safer option there for Lashana. She really should have been like, hey, DJ, win alliance, instead of just being like, hey, Duncan. Hey, Duncan, the person that bullies Harold. Do you want to align with me and Harold? Lashana still gets the reward by crying, you know. Episode 9, DJ still quits. DJ. Imagine being voted out, not for DJ. Episode 10... We forgot Izzy rejoined when Gwen got eliminated. Is she really that important? Well, no, it's just because she gets eliminated here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're right. Uh, goodbye, Izzy.
It was nice knowing She you. She left so soon after she came back. It was either episode up. 10 or 11. Uh, who cares, to be honest? I think 11 was an aftermath. No, that was 12. Which means that it was 11. Uh, so congrats. Courtney comes back. Court yeah, Courtney will still join the gaffers, because I feel like even though Bridget doesn't want to, Harold and Duncan would be fully okay with leaving Lashona in the safe. Yeah, I mean, at this point, even bros, though Bridget has, like has even point. though Bridget has a bigger moral compass, I don't think it would matter. I feel like at this point, now you could tell me I'm wrong. At this point, because this is post the war movie challenge, I think Duncan and Harold have a better relationship, not a good one, but a better one. Yeah, I can see it. In which case, was this a non-nomination? Uh, no, when Courtney came back, that's when everyone voted for Courtney and Owen got right. voted out. so I don't think anything would change. Bridget uh, has no effect on this game. <laughs> not so far, no. Uh, episode 15, I think that Killer Grips would still lose. In which case, I think Lashana, Bridget, and Harold would vote Duncan. Yeah. I feel like, like, I feel like, since her, I mean, since Duncan, because I feel like, I don't, would they even lose that challenge? Uh, what was the challenge in specific? There was the slow motion boxing, which Harold won. There was the ball pit fight, which Courtney won. And then there was the thing. And then there's basketball, which Justin beat Lashana. And then there's the thing that caused the tiebreak. There shouldn't have been a tiebreaker. This is a mad thought. This challenge is dumb. Wait, hold on. Because there was basketball, and then there's also badminton. I mean, we don't need a tiebreaker. Uh, Killer Grips lose. Yeah, yeah, I think they still lose no matter what. Even if Bridget does win in Badminton over Beth, I think Killer Grips still end up losing this one. I figured it was just good to discuss if they would have lost. Just because Heather was a reason for their loss. Yeah, that's fair. Oh my gosh, it's the exact same merge, except replace Duncan with Bridget. <laughs> the best character. Bridget, episode 17 with, um, this is an elimination. I skipped episode 16, because who really cares? Yeah, this one's an elimination. Courtney still wins the superhero. Yeah, Courtney and... still wins. I think at this point, Bridget would be trying to, like, take Lindsay into the group. Not only like take, but be befriend. Yeah, yeah. But I feel like they get rid of Justin, Justin here. Just because everyone seems like they'd be friends. And, like, Justin, I I like action Justin because he's never really an outcast, but he's never really part of the gang, you know? Yeah, he never really forms an attachment with people, which would really be his detriment here. Yeah. Episode Next 19. challenge. I think that would... Princess challenge. Courtney still wins because even if I think, I think Harold would make it to the end. Yeah, but Harold can't beat Courtney in a sword fight. Yeah, he's getting pushed down probably easier than Justin and Cannon. Court Courtney murders Cat Harold canonically. I, I almost eliminated him like he's dead. <laughs> no, but I do think that the group would vote for Beth if yeah. they're getting closer with Lindsay. Yeah, I think they'd vote Beth off. Just because this is since Beth and Lashona do probably still have some beef after how much Lashona kept insisting that Beth's boyfriend was fake. Yeah. Episode... Which I mean he wasn't, but that just means that Beth is unloyal and the worst. Oh, is Owen back? Yes. This okay. is when Owen comes back. Nice to meet you, Owen. Please leave as soon as possible. Ha, huh, you know that won't happen. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> The, the next challenge is the the runway. There's no way Courtney's not winning this. Yeah, Courtney's so. gonna trash the room better than anybody else. Meaning the she only gets way. invincibility. And I think Owen also did. But yeah. So here's what I think would happen. I think 
Lindsay or Bridget and Lindsay would kind of realize, hey, Lashana and Harold are kind of like actually tough competitors. So honestly, they... I don't think they'd realize it. I think Courtney would tell them. Yeah, yeah, like Courtney would definitely be the instigator, and they'd just be like, oh crap, you're right. And so Courtney they'd be get like, rid oh of... man, how's it feel being the third wheel? And they'd get rid of Lashana. Because yeah, they know Harold is seemingly not a strong player. Because they know now that like if they make it to the final three, Lashana and Harold are teaming against them. But at this point, Harold is mad at yeah. Harold is Bridget kind of now out of the group. Lindsay, while Courtney's trying to worm her way into it. Yeah. Harold knows about Owen's traitorous actions now. So he wants Harold gone. Because Owen would win immunity here, because he's the one that canonically made it the longest out of the people left in the spinning thing, and I can't see Bridget or Lindsay making it further than him. There is a case to be made that Harold could have made it longer if there was no but spider in, in there, but by well, using yeah. the cannon, he only lasted like five seconds. Well, oh, well Owen made it ten, so... That's complicated, it's weird. In which but... case... They vote out Harold. They don't yeah, want to vote out Harold, but it's... I don't want to vote out Harold, <laughs> but they vote out Harold. Yeah, it's it's really just the only option, because they are just so... He is actually very strong. Yeah. Was, yeah, action was really Harold's season. He really should have been in the finale with Duncan. Ironically, he up. made it to the same spot. But yeah. When Duncan at... leaves earlier, Harold still can't get a win. <laughs> now we're at episode 24. I think Bridget would take the raccoon. Lindsay, Lindsay would, would lose take... the chameleon. Yeah. Courtney would take the shark. And Owen would still want the bear. Yeah. Owen wouldn't get stuck in one of Duncan's traps, because Duncan isn't here, but he still wouldn't make it back to the camp before Bridget and the raccoon could. Yeah. In which case, she gets immunity. Uh, and I think at, they vote off I think at this Court... point, she's vo they're voting off Courtney. And uh, then Owen gets kicked yeah. off because they also figure out, yeah. That means Bridget and Lindsay are the final two, and... It's really up to you which one you want to make the winner slash runner-up. I'm gonna make Lindsay the winner even though it's Bridget's video. That's just because Brid Bridget's are not a good... I'm gonna say it, and there's gonna be so many hate comments, and you're gonna have to deal with it. Bridget's <laughs> not a good character. All right. Okay, I think if she's a good character. Me, I just don't think she's a good she's contestant. She's a good character. She's an awful contestant. She's a fine character. She people complain to me saying that Bridget should be in All Stars. No, the hell she should not. Bridget sucks. Yeah, once I was like rewatching Island, I realized how like gaslit I was. Cause like the whole series is talking about how good Bridget is when the whole pre-merge is showing off why she should get eliminated. It's literally just because Jeff likes her, and that's why she stays in for so long. Yeah, like, and people are like, oh, she needs a solo season. Like, no, we've already got... She's already had a solo season. And we the saw how that went. Getting, but with that being said, thank you all for watching. Make the doy day yours, and we'll see you with our next contestant, Jeff. Do you want to say anything before this ends? Um... Yeah, somehow Jeff is going to be so much easier. <laughs> <laughs> You're right, actually.